If I ask 10 people, mm -hmm. what would you want to ask Julia more? Why does she look so good? Why does she never age? Why does she just look better and better? Mm -hmm. What would you say, Julie? I'd say I, I stayed out of the sun. I just, I know it's super boring, <laughs> but that's what but I, I think that really, say. really makes a big difference. Have you ever looked at Julianne Moore and wondered, what's her secret? How does she manage to radiate such grace and vitality even at the age of 63? Is it her genes, her lifestyle, or perhaps a secret potion she drinks every morning? Today, we are going to reveal her top five secret habits that contribute to her radiant living and also talk about how these habits have shaped her life especially through her challenging journey with depression and insomnia. Make sure you watch until the end as we give you practical tips on how to incorporate these habits into your own life. One of Julianne's top beauty secrets is her commitment to sun protection. She is known for her porcelain skin and credits her youthful complexion to avoiding sun exposure and wearing sunscreen daily. She said, I can only be in the sun for 15 minutes before burning. I have sunscreen on my face every day. If I'm walking on the sunny side of the street, I'll walk to the shady side. I'm too uncomfortable in the sun. Sun protection is not just about avoiding sunburns or tanning. It's about maintaining healthy skin. The sun's ultraviolet rays can cause premature skin aging, wrinkles, and skin cancer. As we age, our skin becomes more susceptible to the damaging effects of the sun. That's why sun protection is essential for mature skin. Julianne also wears wide-brimmed hats and UV protective clothing, and she tries to stay outdoors in the shade as much as possible. She also avoids peak sun hours, typically between 10 a.m. and 4 p.m., when the sun's rays are the strongest. Julianne never steps out without her sunscreen. She uses a broad-spectrum sunscreen that protects against both UVA and UVB rays. And she doesn't skimp on it either. She applies a generous amount to all exposed areas of her skin, not just her face. And she reapplies it every two hours or immediately after swimming or sweating. Sun protection reduces the risk of skin cancer, the most common form of cancer in the United States. Regular use of sunscreen can significantly reduce the risk of developing skin cancer, especially melanoma, which is the deadliest type of skin cancer. To incorporate this habit, choose a broad-spectrum sunscreen with an SPF of at least 30. You must apply it generously to all exposed skin, not just your face, whenever you go out. Moving on. Julianne believes in the power of a healthy diet. She maintains a diet that's rich in nutrients, and it's one of her secrets to looking radiant and feeling great. Her diet is balanced and includes lots of fish and vegetables. Fish is an excellent source of lean protein and omega-3 fatty acids, essential for heart and skin health. Omega-3 fatty acids help keep the skin hydrated and can even help protect the skin from UV damage. Conversely, Vegetables are packed with vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants that can help fight free radicals, slow down the aging process, and give the skin a healthy glow. Julianne particularly loves dark leafy greens, like spinach and kale, which are rich in vitamins A, C, and E, and broccoli, which is high in vitamin C and selenium. In an interview, she said, I'm always hungry. I think I'm a slender person, but the industry apparently doesn't. All actresses are hungry all the time, I think. She also mentioned, I'm not a morning person. I'm a middle person. I realized recently that my ideal sleep cycle is from midnight to eight. When I can do that, I feel fantastic. Julianne also practices mindful eating. She takes the time to enjoy her meals and listens to her body's hunger and fullness cues. This practice helps her maintain a healthy relationship with food and prevents overeating. As we age, our risk of developing chronic diseases such as heart disease, diabetes, and certain types of cancer increases. A diet rich in fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grains can help reduce this risk. 
If you want to incorporate this habit, try to fill half your plate with vegetables at each meal. Opt for various colors to ensure you're getting a wide range of nutrients. Also, try to include fish in your meals at least twice a week. Next up, Julianne Moore doesn't cut corners when it comes to skincare. She understands the importance of maintaining a regular skincare routine. And facials are a big part of that routine. Julianne is a big fan of regular facial treatments. She often opts for treatments like microneedling and radio frequency. In her own words, it's a bespoke process. She accesses your skin and offers treatments like radio frequency, laser, microneedling, lymphatic drainage, and my favorite, traditional facial massage, until she gets the results she wants. Now, if you're unfamiliar with these terms, don't worry. Let's break them down in a simple way. Microneedling is a procedure that uses tiny needles to prick the skin. This treatment aims to generate new collagen and skin tissue for smoother, firmer, and more toned skin. This process is mainly used on the face and may treat various scars, wrinkles, and large pores. Radio frequency treatments, on the other hand, involve heating the skin using energy waves. These treatments are known to stimulate collagen production and can lead to tighter, younger looking skin. Now, you might be thinking, these treatments sound intensive. Are they right for me? Well, it's always essential to consult a skincare professional before starting new treatments. But the good news is that plenty of at-home treatments can give you similar benefits. For instance, you can try facial massages or jade rolling at home. These techniques can help stimulate blood flow and collagen production, giving your skin a natural glow. They're relaxing and can be a great addition to your self-care routine. And you can also give face masks a try. So many options are available, from hydrating and brightening to anti-aging and exfoliating. You can even make your face mask using natural ingredients like honey, yogurt, or avocado. As we age, our skin loses elasticity and begins to sag. Regular facials can help stimulate collagen production, improving skin elasticity and reducing the appearance of wrinkles and fine lines. Moving on, when it comes to physical wellness, Julianne Moore believes in balance. She doesn't subscribe to extreme fitness routines or fad diets. Instead, she focuses on maintaining a balanced approach to physical activity, including yoga and strength training. In her words, I do Ashtanga yoga three times a week, and I run a couple of times a week, too. I really like yoga. I enjoy the actual doing of it, so it doesn't feel like the agony of the gym felt like to me. Ashtanga yoga is a dynamic and physically demanding practice that synchronizes breath and movement. This form of yoga not only strengthens the body, but also calms the mind. Julianne also incorporates strength training into her routine. This training is essential for maintaining muscle mass, especially as we age. It helps to improve posture, balance, and coordination. Instead of lifting heavy weights, Julianne focuses on functional movements and simple exercises that improve overall body strength. A balanced approach to regular physical activity, like Julianne's, can reduce the risk of developing several diseases, including heart disease, cancer, and diabetes. It can also improve mental health and mood, strengthen bones and muscles, and increase lifespan. If you want to incorporate this habit, start with gentle exercises like walking or chair yoga. Aim for at least 20 to 30 minutes of moderate intensity exercise most days of the week. Remember, starting small and gradually increasing your activity level is okay. The key is to find physical activities that you enjoy and that are suitable for your fitness level. Next up, Julianne's fifth habit is drinking chlorophyll water. She has been doing this for over 15 years. In her own words, the first thing I do is drink two big glasses of water with chlorophyll in it. Someone told me a long time ago that it was really good for your skin. 
so I've always done it. Now, if you don't know what chlorophyll water is, let's break it down. Chlorophyll is the pigment that gives plants their green color. It plays a crucial role in photosynthesis, the process by which plants convert sunlight into energy. When you mix chlorophyll with water, you get chlorophyll water. But why would Julianne, or anyone for that matter, want to drink chlorophyll water? Well, it turns out that chlorophyll has a host of potential health benefits. It's packed with vitamins A, C, E, and K. And it's a good source of antioxidants, which can help protect the body from damage by free radicals. Julianne believes that drinking chlorophyll water is good for her skin, and she might be onto something. Some studies suggest that chlorophyll may have anti-aging effects on the skin, helping to reduce wrinkles and fine lines. It's also been shown to help with acne and other skin conditions. Interestingly, it's also been linked to improved digestion, increased energy levels, and enhanced liver detoxification. Plus, it's a natural deodorizer, so it can help keep your breath fresh. Making chlorophyll water at home is easy. All you need is liquid chlorophyll, which you can find at most health food stores or online, and water. Just add a few drops to a glass of water and enjoy. Start with one glass a day and gradually increase to two or three glasses if you like. Life is not always a smooth ride, and Julianne Moore is no stranger to this fact. She has faced her share of health issues, including depression and insomnia. Depression is a common but serious mood disorder that can affect how you feel, think, and handle daily activities. Julianne has been open about her struggles with depression and how it has affected her life. One of the ways Julianne managed her depression was through regular exercise. She found that yoga and strength training not only helped her stay physically fit, but also improved her mood and reduced her stress levels. Exercise is known to stimulate the production of endorphins, chemicals in the brain that act as natural mood lifters. Moving on, insomnia is a sleep disorder that can make it hard to fall asleep, hard to stay asleep, or cause you to wake up too early and not be able to get back to sleep. Julianne experienced bouts of insomnia, which left her feeling tired and drained. But she found relief in an unexpected place, her diet. Julianne noticed that when she ate a balanced diet rich in fish, vegetables, and chlorophyll water, her sleep improved. She also found that practicing mindful eating helped her relax and prepare for a good night's sleep. Julianne has managed to overcome these challenges thanks in part to her healthy habits. By incorporating these habits into your lives, you too can enjoy a graceful and radiant living. So, which of Julianne's habits resonated with you the most? Are you ready to incorporate them into your own routine? Do you have any wellness habits of your own that you'd like to share? Let us know in the comments below. And if you found this video helpful, we think you'll love Sally Field's health tips.